Alright, I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna slide down this bad boy. I think that'll help, right? I hope so, at least. I hope it takes me exactly where I need to go. Maybe I could even glide a little, get me a little distance. That's cool. Oh, they're racing. Ow! That was rude. If I follow their tracks, I can find out where they're headed. I can probably use my focus to follow the tracks those riders left behind. I don't want to. Unless part of the main story, which I don't I doubt it is. <laughs> what was that? Whoa, what is this? Uh let's uh I guess we'll have this just in case. Hey, look, it's a sign. This used to be a road, I'm assuming. The machine riders from before. The ones who were racing. I wonder what they're up to. I won the race. Hey, I don't care. Let's go. I literally ended up not caring about finding them, and I accidentally ended up finding them. Interesting. I might as well discover these, uh, how far is it? I'm not a hundred percent sure. I'm pretty sure it's on the opposite side. And if that's the case, I can't find, I won't be able to find that, uh, <clears throat> whoa. I could always just jump from up here, though. Oh, I'm so doing it. Can I go that way, though? I don't know if I'm going to regret to regret this later. But I'm going to do it. These guys aren't bad guys, are they? Okay, that's all I wanted. I just wanted that right there, because I, I need to go to this main quest. <clears throat> but it's very... It's not far anymore, but still. Well, that pig sounded disgusting. Those pigs sound pretty realistic. How far is this thing, man? Dang. It's a lot of uh, mountainous terrain that I gotta go around too. <clears throat> to be fair though, I'm probably do going there in the worst possible way. Pretty sure we're getting there now though. Let me see. What? Not even close. Oh look, it's a tornado. Uh, goodbye. Go to ether. My God, this is so far. Ow. Well, uh... I'm being hunted. Luckily, there's a bunch of these medicinal berries that don't look like berries at all, but it's okay. There's a campfire that I want to find right over here. I really got to start discovering these more often. I've screwed myself over numerous amount of times by not discovering them multiple times. Oh no, I can't quick save. It's probably because they're looking for me. 
Yeah, this is the closest one too. My god, dude, because then we still have to go this one. That's Poseidon, and then we gotta go to this one. Demeters, or whatever his name is. Might as well grab that while we're waiting. Let's go ahead and grab that. Max that out. Two more. We should be able to max this out too. Two, four, six. That's already six. That's already eight. We're golden. We're still going to stay there. <clears throat> oh, shoot. It's a freaking... Oh, that looks beautiful. Those things have always been magical, even in Zero Dawn. Why can't I save it here? Okay. I guess I'm screwed. I discovered it though, so even though I can't quick save, I should be able to just come back here whenever, right? I hope that's the case. Because if not, I'm screwed. So, as I said in the previous video, uh, just so that you guys are fully aware, uh, the previous videos, that ESO video that I made, um, I'm not sure how long this video is going to be. Uh, I recently had COVID, so, uh, I kind of, sort of, been recovering from that, you know? So, I feel a lot better, I feel way better, but still not at 100%. So, there's that. I don't want to get too into it though in this video. I feel like I talked about it a little extensively in my previous video. So, <clears throat> but just know I'm fine. I am doing a lot better. I am vaccinated. So, there's that. These guys are going to want to attack me. Get up, Aloy. Yeah, I, I am feeling a lot better, though. So that's the good thing. Definitely grabbing that bad boy. Discovered shelter? The whole landscape changed. I'm getting close to Ether's location. I said it would be in some kind of physical processor. This place was insanely far. It's ridiculous. And this was the closest one of all things. Oh, there it is. An ancient ruin. Turned into a Tanakh stronghold? We're gonna have to kill them, aren't we? Poking around's not gonna be easy with Tanakh's warriors everywhere. Uh. Many more soldiers killed since. The Hagala's army only grows in strength. Let me let me just try to walk up. Struck a blow to us at the embassy. This much is true, but we are made of steel. We will not yield. They're made of steel. Regala's forces may seem strong now, but... Her machines took out my entire squad. Remember the visions. The old ones didn't choose their fight, but still, they stood firm. They didn't falter. And neither will we. How, do the, how does she know? Blood of the Ten. You've come to us. You know who I am? Oh, the warrior with hair like wildfire who defeated Regala's champion at Baron Lai. <laughs> yes, you are known to us. I am Decca, chaplain of the Lowland clan. You've come to speak with Chief Hikaro. Not quite. There's, there's something I need here. Anything you need, the Chief will provide. Come. Is that one of the visions you were talking about? <coughs> yes. 
the records of the ten. I can show you them, if you like, on the way to the chief. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Uh, what are the visions? These visions. You said they're the records of the ten. Who are they? Old ones. Who fought a heroic battle against machines on this very soil long ago. Their deeds are honored in the visions. <laughs> At least what remains of them. To be remembered and exalted. There used to be more of these visions? Many more. Once this place was filled with light and sound. But over the years, they've fallen into darkness. One by one. That is why chaplains are so important to the tribe. <coughs> we remember all we can of the visions. Etched in our flesh. Passed down by word of mouth from generation to generation. One day the whole grove may go dark. But chaplains who come after me will keep the memories alive. Okay, uh... Hikaru wants to see me? Why does Hikaru want to see me? We are at war with Regatta. And you've already shown that you can stand against her. I'm not here to fight a war for you. Not for us. With us. But I won't try to persuade you. That is for the chief. He can be very convincing. And of course we're going to do it. Chaplain? What does it mean to be a chaplain here? We who outlast our youth study the visions and share their wisdom with our young. What kind of wisdom? How to be a true warrior. To fight with bravery and unflinching honor. And to know when to call for peace. You can see for yourself when we go inside. I got nothing out of that, by the way. All right. To Hikaru. Let's go see Chief Hikaru. He's in his throne room at the far end of the grove. Come. Be welcome among the records of the ten. Records of the ten. Track, tracking. Let's go. The Memorial Grove. I want to... This is what I'm more interested in. She was kind of boring. She did not give me anything. It's glitched. That's military. Complete. Their full truths are lost to us. It's a chaplain's duty to make sense of these visions as best we can. Yeah, it looks like military training. The ten were dedicated soldiers. Working together as a squad and sharing in their duty. And when the time came for battle, they took to the skies and leaped to glory. All Tanakh seek to follow their example. For the chief, it was one of the few things the clans had in common. Okay, that's interesting. They're probably like some airborne people, maybe? I don't know. Okay, we got some more in here. Let's look at this one next. Mountain. The, war, the ten climbed sheer rock, braving blinding snow and wind. They stopped at nothing to protect their own. You make them sound invincible. They weren't. But the visions tell us of their courage and strength. Something our soldiers aspire to. The Sky Clan admires this one above all the rest. They make their home in the mountains northwest of here. Hmm. I think it was the mountain, not the ten. I could be wrong, but... Oh, it is the 10. <coughs> What's this one about? The 10 waged war against their enemy in the desert heat. A land too harsh for any to survive. 
But against all odds, they prevailed. So the Desert Clan does the same. We must have passed through their territory on the way here. They did. They sound a little extreme. They take that as a compliment. Okay, that's interesting. To say the least. Okay, looks like we got a couple more. Let me see here. Should I go this way? It looks like that's actually where I'm supposed to be going. Let me take a look, a quick peek over here at the- Yeah, okay, yeah. This is the one that I want first. Soldiers in a jungle. Those were the ten? Yes. They knew how to use the jungle's depths to distract the enemy until the perfect hey, moment to strike. Said that relic you wear. Generations ago, my clan, the Lowland, looked to this one for inspiration as they claimed the jungle to the southwest. Interesting. Right, let me talk to this girl real quick. Recording? This box was speaking with voices of the old ones, but now there's noise over them. Let me take a look. Where did you find this? We took it from an Asaram Delver. She was trying to steal it and other artifacts from Tanakh's territory. The others were going to bury it in the sand with her. But then I heard the voices. Well, the data here is badly corrupted, but... Delta Juliet 9, you are weapons free and clear to engage the swarm. Good hunting. Copy that. We'll buy Zero Dawn the time you need. Delta Juliet 9, out. The voices of warriors from the past. And that Osiram wanted to sell them for shards. The bravery of the Ten should be remembered. I'm not sure what you mean by the Ten. These voices came from the final battle with the Old Ones. Another battle? I could learn more about it if I could find the other boxes. That Delver did say there might be more recordings to be found in the wreckage of ancient flying machines. She claimed she had a way to locate them. Yeah, the black box. The box with the voice data on it is emitting a locator signal. I could use it to find the others. If you do then, bring them back here. I will see to it that they're treated with proper respect. Whatever sacrifices were made by these ancient soldiers, we will honor them. That's cool. Uh, trade in Let recordings? Me know when you have one that you'll part with. <coughs> that... Interesting. Osram Delvers. Do you get many Osram Delvers in Tanakh's territory? Fewer every time we catch them, but those thieving rats would do anything for the shards. There'll always be some who'll risk coming here. And what do you do with the ones you catch? Delvers spend their lives in the dust. So we bury them in it. Alive. Why collect these voices? Why do you want these recordings? Every battle teaches its soldiers. We should learn those lessons and honor those who fell. That is our way. I'll be on my way. If I find <coughs> more of those recordings, I'll bring them back to you. I'm sorry if I'm uh, yawning a lot. I'm not actually tired. It's just uh, having been sick for almost two weeks. It just kind of left me in the state of very, very low energy. So my body just wants to continue resting. Should help me to find any others that are still out there. Yeah, we've we've been through that, Aloy. The chief is inside. Are you ready <clears throat> to see him? Absolutely. I'm ready. Good. Come. I should have scanned that thing that was on the ledge behind her. Oh well. <clears throat> Ooh. It's underneath the throne.
He has no arm. Soon, Outlander. The savior of Meridian. I am told you held back Regala's forces outside Baron Light. And defeated her champion, Grutta. In single combat. Impressive. I met Fashav there, too. He said you were a great warrior. And a man of honor. His death is a painful loss among many. We will not soon recover from the massacre of our marshals. But if you are here to pledge your service, that could help considerably. I am not here to fight for you. I need something in that basement. Something that will save many lives, yours included. It's not something you can see, but it is there. I have seen it. You have named your price. Now I name mine. Oh, With snap. With my marshals dead, I need <coughs> your spear. Help me defeat my enemies, and I will grant you access to the chamber below. I, I mean, he is. Price. I am not a hired killer. I'm here to save lives, more than you can count. I count the corpses of Marshal slain. I count hundreds more to knock them, whose lives hang in the balance. I will fight for them. I will kill anyone who threatens the peace, and you will too, if you want me to open the door to the chamber below. Okay. So by that logic, what's stopping me from killing you right now? And taking what I need to save everyone. What is wrong with her? You could try. You might even succeed. Either way, you must fight. My way might hold off Regala and the slaughter she craves. Fine. What do you need? I need more marshals to keep the tribe together. Such warriors can only be promoted at a trial by combat called the Cool Route. I've sent out a call for the competition. But since Regala seeks to undermine me, she is certain to attack it. She'll want to kill me in front of the assembled clans. So what, you want me to be your bodyguard? No. To defend the Cool Route. But there is more. Knowing Regala will attack, one of the clans have balked at sending their contestants. You must go north and force Takote, the commander of the Sky Clan, to submit and send his best. Force him to submit? Do whatever is necessary. I can't hold the cool route with two of the three clans in attendance. Marshal Kathala will assist you. He was maimed at Baron Light, but he can still be of use. I sent him ahead to the northern village of Stone Crest. Meet him there, and he will guide you to the Sky Clan stronghold. If you have any questions about your mission, now is the time. I'm sorry, but Aloy is really not likable in this story. And if we've are we're hours in, and she's still not likable it's i don't like her in this game I, i'm sorry i just don't like her uh fashav i'm sorry about fashav he seemed like a good man more <coughs> than a man a bridge between tanakh and karja no outlander ever earned our respect as he did i had hoped he would be my voice in meridian that peace with the karja might become something more an alliance in exchange the karja have much we lack our deeds are written in ink upon our bodies our memories die with our flesh but the karja never forget their deeds are written in book and scroll you wanted to learn from them as i learned from Pashaw, he will be missed i like this guy uh regalia Pashav called regala your greatest mistake why? That is not your concern. Really? I fought against her forces at Baron Light, and I don't even know what her problem is. 
She <laughs> was the deadliest of my marshals, the point of my spear. So what happened? Above all, Regala despises the Karja who burned her younger brothers alive. After we turned back the Red Raids and tore down the battlements of Baron Light, she hoped to chase them all the way to Meridian. She could not see the cost of such a war, nor the benefits of peace after the Mad Sun King fell. When I accepted Avad's entreaties, she went mad, called me traitor, challenged me before the marshals. Wow. Regala's challenge? What did you do when Regala challenged you? If you were to knock, you would know that such a challenge cannot be refused. <clears throat> it was not easy to subdue her. I bear seven scars from that fight. The other marshals wanted me to execute her on the spot. But I found I could not sever the bond between us. Her loyalty had been as boundless as her rage. So I spared her. Rather than mercy, she took it as a humiliation. One she will never be free from. So now she wants her revenge, basically. Regala's goal? So Regala wants you dead. She does. But that will not be enough. She won't rest until all three clans fall in behind her as she marches on Meridian. Who knows? With machines under her control, perhaps she can raise it to the ground. It's been tried before. So I hear. Yeah, well, uh, the Kul Root. What exactly is the Kul Root? Where once the clans fought each other, now we fight as one against the machines. That is my law made manifest in the Kul Root. Each clan must send contestants whenever I call for the ritual. These contestants face trial by combat against machines in an arena just beyond these walls. Those who distinguish themselves become marshals who bind the tribe together as peacekeepers. Peacekeepers? You called them peacekeepers, but the marshals I met at the embassy were warriors. Warriors, yes, but more. They renounce the clan that birthed them and pledge themselves to order and peace. They enforce my law. They settle disputes and stand for Tanakh in parlay with other tribes. Without them, I cannot rule. Which is why you must ensure the next cool route takes place. Okay, the Sky Clan. You call Oops. them peacekeepers. <laughs> Warriors, they renounce, they enforce and stand for without them. Okay, the Sky Clan. Why won't the Sky Clan send contestants to the Cool Root? Of the three clans, they have the most defensible base, protected by a mighty wall called the Bulwark. Their commander believes he can wait out the war between Regala's forces and my own, safe behind his barrier. Staying strong, while you and Regala weaken each other. You think like a seasoned marshal. Good. Why me? Why send me to deal with the Sky Clan? All Tanakh respects strength, and you drove Regala back at Baron Light. That and most of your marshals are dead? Correct. What about Catalo? Can't he do it by himself? He is maimed. They will no longer respect him. That hardly seems fair. What is fair about losing an arm? Whether they respect him or not, Catalo still has worth. He knows the Sky Clan. He was raised in their base. He will guide you well. He's, I like this guy. He's not wrong. Uh, the chamber below. You said you saw what's in the basement? I did. On the day of my greatest victory. What do you mean? For a dozen generations, the three clans battled for control of this hallowed ground. Only I achieved it. I fought for years. Killed whoever stood in my way. When I had finally slain all rivals, I stood alone in the grove. Victory was mine to save her, or so I thought. Thunder roared from the east, and a bolt of blue struck this place. That chamber. Gaia dies, and Aether arrives. All around me, the visions of the grove grew louder and brighter, and suddenly a new one appeared before me. The old ones spoke, and what they said changed everything. 
The old ones? What did the old ones say to you in this new vision? The one called Faraday foretold the growing danger of the machines and said we must unify to stop them. She called for marshals to enforce the peace. Then the vision faded, never to be seen again. I marked the spot where it shone with my spear, and I took Faraday's words to heart. Renounced war between the clans, trained warriors to fight machines, ordained marshals through the cool route. Since then, the tribe has been at peace until Regala attacked at Baron Light. And the chamber beneath the throne. You went in after the vision? I did. Inside is an ancient device. It hums with power. You will see it for yourself after the cool route. This I swear. He seems like an honorable man. I believe him. I'll go north then. I'll do what you want. <coughs> I'll go north to deal with Dakota. But you'd better not forget about our deal. You Shut have up! Promise. If you succeed, speak to Deca on your way out. She will arm you for the road ahead. God damn, Aloy. She just needs to shut the hell up. <laughs> She's so unlikable, dude. I, I cannot be her friend. Me and her, I would literally tell her to shut the fuck up. But like, dude, go away. You and me are not compatible, homegirl. It's that simple. Come, let us speak. What happened? Hikaru said you have something for me? A weapon to aid your mission. Ooh. You'll need it for the long road to Stonecrest. Many machines prowl along the way, and our scouts have sighted Regala's rebels in the area. Machines and rebels. Nothing I haven't faced before. Indeed. Head north towards the foothills. Ascend its slopes until your legs burn and the chill air catches in your chest. Then you'll know you're in the Sky Clan's domain. Strike true as the ten, Aloy. The ten it shall be. Wait, what are I, uh, tear precision arrows can now be available once- Ooh. They're- that's on a different kind of bow though, right? Triple notch. All oh, the other ones still. Triple notch and high volley. Okay. Cool. If I'm gonna get ether, guess I'll have to play along with Akaro. Better meet up with Marshal Catalo at Stonecrest. It'll be faster if I ride a machine. What's this place? What? Do I not have one? Can I not call my mount? That's... It's kind of depressing, actually. You live to... F live another day. My god. Dude, Aloy is so unlikable, it's insane. I don't understand because... In Zero Dawn, the, the Zero Dawn was amazing. This one is good too. Don't get me wrong. This is a good game. I'm really enjoying this game. It's just Aloy. Aloy is not likable to say the least. I kind of low-key really dislike her. Like there's this confusion that strength means you have to be alone. You know? opposite of that actually what was that what is going on just die already soldiers in trouble the machine looks like it could flatten boulders trees me Please, eh. stranger, help me kill this thing. Eh, 
You guys will be alright. <laughs> I'm Aloy, I do everything by myself. I can't help you guys assisting. I am Aloy Himi Roar. It kind of makes me sad to a certain extent, though, because, as I've said before, Zero Dawn was, uh, was one of my favorite games of last generation, you know? And then you have this one that, although I like it, it would still score high so far. If I was to just stop right now and give it a rating, it'll probably be 7-8. Eh, It'll be pretty high still, you know. But it's disappointing because Zero Dawn was so good in my opinion. It was like a nine, you know. And this one is just—it's kind of disappointing in the sense that I wanted it to be better. They've improved in some stuff. I, I will—I will admit that. But. I don't know. I'm kind of disappointed with this game to a certain extent. But that's not to take away. I, I do want to make it perfectly clear. If you guys, if this is like a perfect game for you personally, uh, by all means, I'm glad you're enjoying it, man. It's just... It's got a lot of problems in my eyes. Am I supposed to be going this way? Probably not. No, <laughs> I'm not. I think I could just glide down, right? Well, I mean, I don't really have a choice. Okay, I'm gliding. This, this feature right here is awesome. Oh, oh, oh. Dude, <laughs> I didn't even see them. Run. <laughs> that was uh, unexpected. You can't find me. Oh, that's not a bad guy. Not one more step. The Tanakh don't suffer outlanders in the clan lands. I was given right of passage by Marshal Fashav. I'm not here to fight. They're like blood. This is the warrior who defeated Gruda, champion of the traitor Regala. Her life in the flesh is to take you may enter but mind our ways you will be watched I'll keep that in mind this must be stonecrest Katola should be waiting for me but maybe I should look around first oh stone crest for some reason I was thinking stone crust I heard you got some fresh ink. What'd you do? there's so much stuff here are you looking to trade? You know what? Sure. No. <laughs> All right. Screw it. I'm leaving. Where's Gatolo? Hey, I found him. Hello. This valley is infested with regardless rebels. The scouts from the village tell us that they've been moving machines through here for days. Some they ride, others they herd along, and some they even strip for parts. Especially cannons. The path ahead will not be easy. We should get going. 
My orders are to guide you to the bulwark so that you can speak to Dakota. For all the good it'll do. Not so fast. I'm gonna need a little more than that. Here she goes again. Be honest. If somebody was to talk to you the way Aloy talks to everyone, how would you react? Personally, to be fair, in this specific situation, he was kind of being a dick too. But she's doing this to everybody. Even people that are not being assholes to her. You know, if I wasn't being an asshole to her and she was to speak to me like that, I'd be like, yo, relax. It's your problem. You know? Her attitude is just really freaking annoying. It's almost childish. Stonecrest. What is this place? Stonecrest was built as an outpost back when the clans were still at war. Its purpose was to guard the entrance to the valley, as well as keep watch on what happens below. And for now, that means keeping watch on Regala's forces. I wish we had enough soldiers to do more than just look on. Okay, uh, for all the good it'll do? For all the good it'll do? What's that supposed to mean? The bulwark has stood unyielding since the birth of our clan. Behind it, Tecote believes himself to be invulnerable. If he insists on defying Hikaru's orders, an outlander and a maimed marshal aren't gonna change his mind. Your chief seems to think differently. And that is the only reason I am still standing here. Talking to you. Damn. Uh, the bulwark? What makes the bulwark <clears throat> so impenetrable? It's made of massive boulders. Impervious to any frontal assault. No army or machine has ever penetrated it. I am the only thing that can get you inside. If we're done talking, that is. Uh... Takote. What makes you so sure Takote won't listen to us? A snake safe in its lair hears nothing but its own rattle. Come on, is that all you've got for me? <laughs> Hikaru said you were from the Sky Clan before becoming a marshal. I need to know what you know. Takote is a petty, vindictive schemer. If he had any guts, he would have gone after Hikaru long ago. But instead, he covets the chieftain from behind the bulwark. Biding his time. Hoping that his foes will weaken one another. Is that enough for you? <laughs> no, I still got two more choices. Uh... I understand. I kind of understand why he's so angry, though. You know, he doesn't have an arm anymore. But the chief was right in saying that he still has worth and value. I wish he himself saw that. But I can understand why he's angry, you know? Regal's machines. Why do you think Regal's forces are driving machines through the valley? We've heard similar reports from across the clan lands. The rebels are gathering machines from the wilds. But whatever control they have over them doesn't seem to last. So they herd them into camps. Something else happens there. Something... Something that makes their control permanent. An override with two phases. I... Don't know about that. I do. But it gets worse. We've heard rumors that the rebels are scouting larger machines. I don't know what kind. Let's hope they don't learn how to override them, too. You're still healing. You were at the embassy. I was. I'm sorry about the other marshals. And their deaths will not go unpunished. <clears throat> You're still healing. I will never heal. But that won't stop me from cracking any skulls that need it. He's then angry. You're on my side, then. <clears throat> uh, the way to Bulwark? So, what's the plan? The Bulwark is to the southwest. So, undoubtedly, <coughs> we'll have to cross paths with Regala's troops along the way. We'll either have to fight our way through, 
or find a way to sneak past unnoticed. Neither will be easy. Never is. <laughs> Let's get this over with. You obviously haven't met me then. I could do everything because I am Aloy and I am flawless. I I just wanna talk. There is nothing wrong with me whatsoever. I am perfect. I am the strongest thing in the period. His challengers? I wouldn't. <sighs> Come on. To not respect a blade and the strength of the fighter who wields it. Who does anyone who lacks that? Well, lucky for us, we're both good fighters, but let's hope it won't come to that. Hmm. So this whole valley is the Sky Clan's territory? <laughs> yes. The clan has defended it for generations. Against who? The other Tanakh clans. Even the Karja, long ago. If you want a history lesson, talk to the chaplains. Rebels ahead. Hacking away at that machine. Got them? Or Where? Sneak around. I will follow. The is blanketing the land. That was this. Oh, I missed. For the fallen marshals, alarm! Back them up. I hate using those. Not gonna lie. But they are strong. Is he dead? He's dead. <laughs> okay, enough of that. shouldn't be fighting these guys they're actually pretty tough give me one second all right let me let me do some quick looting you never know what I'm gonna find on these guys while I'm at it I might as well is this a oh it is yeah I think I'm gonna start sneaking around them Okay, yeah, there we go. Now we are Those rebels were fully done. machine parts, maybe to make more overrides. And Takote won't do anything? Why would he when he has the bulwark? I grew up behind the wall. It's easy to have a false sense of safety there. I've more seen rebels. Lord of the Rings in the clearing. Take the lead. Where? Oh, those guys right there? We must remain vigilant. You don't see nothing. Oh yeah, there's more of the shield guys. You don't see nothing. I think I made it. These are good guys, right? We're out of sight. Let's move. Okay, good. Back at Stonecrest, you said the rebels have been moving through here for days. By the time Takote realizes he's outmatched, this entire valley might be overrun. If not for the sake of the rest of the clan, I would welcome that day. To see his pride ruined. 
Okay, well, maybe we can change his mind. Here it or. is. The bulwark. Let me know when you are ready. No oh, wow. Us. I'm actually ready. That looks so cool, by the way. That makes a lot of noise for being so small. <clears throat> you there! A marshal requests an audience with your clan commander. I didn't know there were any marshals left. We defend the path to the mountain, where the wings of the ten shall find us. All right, marshal. I'll send the lift for you. So the only way in is through a lift. That's interesting. That would be pretty difficult to penetrate in that if that's the case. <clears throat> what is that? When we meet with Takote, I'll do the talking. We'll see how it goes. I wonder what that was. a thriving little community back again so this was home a long time ago come on all right after you so we're just taking it slow is that what we're doing Uh -huh. <laughs> that person runs funny. Can we like speed this up? Oh, if I run, he runs. Where are you going? Well, this is a warm welcome. An outlander and a maimed marshal. Spectacle. Reminds me of where I grew up. I never decided which was worse. When they shunned me or when they stopped and stared. Shall we? We're here? Talk to the guard. Hello. We're here for Takote. Let us in. Sounds like a Mexican beer. I'm here for Tecate. <laughs> oh, that guy eats disgusting. Which one's... Okay, I see. The Sky Clan's mighty son returns. Bless the ten. Your chief has demanded an immediate dispatch of all challengers to the cool route. We're here to make sure yours haven't gotten lost on their way to the grove. I see. Regala must have dealt our chief a mighty blow if he's sending you two as messengers. This one defeated Regala's champion, Grutta, at the embassy. She fought honorably. I had the sense to bar our soldiers from that embassy, just as I have the sense now to keep our challengers here. If they must fight, then they will fight here. Defending our walls. Our clan. That wall won't protect you. Not from the machines Regala controls. They're already at your doorstep. <laughs> and what do you know of the battles that the Bulwark has withstood? The blood shed upon stone. I know it wasn't meant to be used as a coward's shield. You were a great warrior once. But that was then. Tell Hakaro, with all due respect, that we will keep our challengers here for as long 
as we are safe behind the bulwark. He is a coward. He is definitely a coward. I told you, words are useless with his kind. We're gonna have to kill him. It won't be easy with all his men above. Are you even listening? She's gonna destroy the wall. For as long as we are safe behind the bulwark, he said. She's gonna destroy the wall. Wait here. <coughs> I need to get a closer look at that wall. What? Why? Because she's gonna destroy it. Duh. Such a stupid idea, but. Well, Alright, I'm jumping. As strong as Takote thinks it is. I need to get down to the base of it and check it out. The bulwark. Okay. Beaten already, Outlander. Oh, just you wait. <coughs> I need to get a little distance from the wall. I'm gonna scan it properly. Okay. You tell me when, Aloy, since you you're a miss know it all. Hey, time to scan the wall. Do I do it this way? There it is. Just what I thought. There's something metal in there. Oh, that rock is interfering with the scan. I need to get closer. But how? I might be able to climb up on the left side of the wall. Near that waterfall. I don't see no waterfall. <coughs> but the map marker's there, so. How the hell did you see this waterfall, Aloy? Where is this water coming from? It's true. Okay, let's go. We're definitely gonna destroy this wall, aren't we? The water's flowing into the wall. Towards a hollow place. Rocks here might give way if I pry at them. Wow. Now, better scan that tank again. I'll bet if I blew it up. But how? Well, can't do anything else here. Better go find Catalo. She said blow it up. She's legit. What the hell? There we go. I got stuck. Okay, so. Where's Catalo? Okay, so he's just over here somewhere. There he is. Hello. Long time no see. The guard said you've been scurrying around the wall like a rat. What in the name of the town have you been up to? Dakota said he wouldn't send his challengers as long as they're safe behind the bulwark. Right? Don't remind me. So? We take it down. <laughs> Surprise! Did you hit your head on the way down here? I'm serious. There's something from the old world stuck in there. And it has a power cell. I could blow it up if I just penetrate the first layer of rock and Even metal. Even if what you're saying is true, it would take a cannon to do that. You're right. And you said the rebels were stripping them off machines back in the valley. Come on. No. I'm not getting dragged further into this madness. Hikaru ordered you to help me. You gonna defy him like that arrogant shit up there? <laughs> oh, that's funny. That was an unkind comparison. <laughs> okay. That was a funny Rebels comparison. A camp northeast of here. And then what? The two of us go up against all of them? Pretty much, yeah. Oh, you may lack sense, but you don't lack courage. So, um, back there with Dakota, it seemed like there's bad blood between you two. There is. If we make it through this plan of yours, perhaps I'll tell you. I'll hold you to that. See, that sounds... Close to where we saw the rebels before. That sounds more respectful. Respectable. It's like more respectable answer. Well, it looks 
like the rebels just got a lot more firepower. Ready? Move out! Holy crap! Focus on the others. I'll follow you in. Even for having one arm, Homeboy has a great. Maybe I should see if there's anything I can use to take that thing down. My focus He's a good fighter. Float up, squad. Soon we march. The Sky Clan will fall. Let me see. Maybe I should. Stealthfully take care of this guy. Good night. For Narnia! Is that all? That's all? I oh god, I really thought I had more than that. <laughs> his, his head kind of bobbled a little. Yes, that is a very big thing. Very, very big thing. Oh, now you done. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> what? I have no idea what happened to her. Oh! Whoa, that was a good dodge. That was not. On. Dead. Oh, so am I. Okay. Note to self. Kill as many ground troops as I can first. Maybe I should see if there's anything I can use to take that thing down. My focus can help. Load up, squad. Soon we march. The Sky Clan will fall. All right. <clears throat> and dead. I want to pick this up, but honestly, it's it's kind of too early for it. Oh, this guy. He's alone, too. Okay, we're doing good. So this is where I died last time. There's nobody actually up there this time. Oh wait, this... This might help. Could use that in the fight. What's this? Oh, it's a grapple point. I don't see any enemies though. Alright, I, I think I'm just gonna fight.
I think I'm just gonna fight. Ready? For Narnia! I found the weakness. It's a horrible weakness. God, this thing is enormous. Well, I have no idea what happened there. Oh! You don't see nothing? Oh, I'm gonna need these. Oh, I need them now. I don't even know what I shot. But I like it. Oh god. I mean, he's almost dead. I'm not worried about you guys. Oh, did I destroy the bottom? I destroyed the bottom thing. That's what it was. Watch out. Will you sit still? Get up! God damn it, I gotta run. Run! Hello. That health is definitely gonna come in handy. Where'd he go? Might as well pick him off a little bit from here. Who just shot at me? This guy is terrifying. Oh, that's my friend. You see them? I'm going to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. That thing is strong. Let's go more damage. Oh! Let's uh, get behind cover. Sounds like a good plan too. Oh god, they're right there. You know what? Let's go ancient willy mammoth hunting. This guy's hard. What am I get? Really? He's almost dead. Come over here, buddy. Oh! Come this way. Fuck! I needed those. Oh, 
Oh! He shot me with his ass! Is he dead? Almost. I almost beat him! No! That was disappointing. So now that I know that his belly is the weakness, I'm gonna definitely focus the attack on the belly. <laughs> that was actually pretty cool. I've never seen that one, that kill a animation before. I, <laughs> I gotta aim for the belly. Perfect. Perfect. Oh! Who's attacking me? What is he doing? I saw that just too late. So that plan is a good plan. Except I need to add on to it. I need to destroy his belly, make my way around the back, and destroy the back canisters. Or maybe I should focus on the dude that's up top. Yeah, I think I'm gonna focus on the dude up top. I wanna- I wanna see what that does. Alright, here goes nothing. Where's the guy up there? Oh, he's already dead! Where's the- there they are. Oh! I gotta kill this freaking person because she freaking... She hit me hard. I mean, it worked. Oh! This guy is fucking terrifying! How the? Sit your ass down. is very tough this guy is very tough and I like it what the hell is this guy talking about all right I got an, I got another idea I'm still gonna do this exact same plan
Except I'm gonna go take out this dude as well. Perfect. Sent to my stash. That's not good. It's time for battle. Again. The good thing is that the dude up top dies with this too. Oh, that's not gonna work. It would be nice to be able Oh fuck. Okay. I need to get at those. Ooh! Maybe I should hit his butt cannons. I cannot stay close to him. Who the hell? She's using some sort of climbing gear. Duh. Please don't kill me. Okay. How are we gonna take him out? <laughs> There's more of them around here somewhere. Cause I could hear him saying, shoot the outlander. Not 100% sure, there he is. How was that a miss? Dunzo. You're not gonna get me. Let me go ahead and do this real quick. stuck on that was close those things are freaking brutal by the way <laughs> leave my friend alone what get up where do those freaking people come from I messed up. I see you. Nice. Oh my god, this is a freaking tough fight. Where's Big Where's Big Daddy? Found him.
slingshot, baby. Not really sure why I'm going with that, but okay. Yeah, he is. He is strong. Pick him up. Revive? He's not even dead. Ah! I'm not gonna lie, I totally forgot how to use... Those ultimate abilities. <clears throat> um, so I still got three of these bad boys. Oh, that that was very painful. Dude, Hobie keeps getting blown up. It's fucking funny. Ooh, that that electrical attack. You know what? I'm safe here. No, I'm not. Definitely not safe there. I did it. Woo. That was good. I'm not looking forward to hauling this all the way to the bulwark. Here. I may be maimed, but I've still got a strong back. He's a good guy. I like him a lot, actually. She has a lot to learn from him. After you. How far are we running to? Oh, we're not going far at all. You fought well back there. I did not think we'd survive. Me either. Killing the rebels and the machine. It was good to take the fight to them for once. You really think this thing will do the job? I hope. You're not gonna say anything? The conversation just stopped randomly. I need to refill my uh my medicinal pouch. So so now what? Here it is. But you don't just need a cannon. You need a miracle. Coming right up? Well, go on. Okay. Oh, God. Gotta blast away some rocks. Gotta expose the power cell. It's working! Am I hitting it? There we go. This isn't gonna work. Well, isn't this impressive? Two children playing siege. <laughs> I hope they haven't hurt the bulwark's feelings. Come now, stop embarrassing yourselves. 
and leave this poor mountain alone. This is your last chance, Takote. You can still answer Hikaru's call. This is your last chance. You have it backwards. Leave this place, Savage, now, and take this cripple with you. This is it. Way to go, dumbass. And now your wall's worthless. What have you done? Can't hide behind the wall anymore, Takote. Now you have to join Hikaru. Never. Never. We will... We will rebuild it. Immediately. You are not safe. The bulwark couldn't protect you from a single cannon. Let alone an army of machines. The only pathway to safety is to unite against Regala with your chief. You decreed that no challenges would be sent, while the clan remained safe behind the bulwark. So send them now. Unless your word means nothing. That's a leader. Send them. I didn't hear you. Send the challengers. I look forward to seeing the Sky Clan's colors in the arena. That's a leader. Nicely done, Marshal. What's gonna happen to this place? They'll have to live without their wall. But that's better than living apart from the tribe, as pawns in Dakota's foolish schemes. If you want to check up on them, talk to Jera. The chaplain of the clan. If anyone needs help up there, she'll know. Yeah. Maybe I will. I'll take my leave then. I need to report to Hikaru. I'll see you at the culvert. Good. We may need another miracle there as well. Perhaps. <laughs> That that wall literally could be could have been saved. Can I not? I can't fast travel there, can I? Well, I guess I could he go here. Yep. I don't care. I'll use it, even though there's probably a freaking one right around where I was that I could have used to travel for free. But it's okay. Where am I? Okay, we're at the broken sky. Got it. All right. Uh, that museum place. Outlander, Chief Akaro and Marshal Katalo await you within. Sounds like a plan. Thank you. Memorial Grove. The cool route should be starting soon. Once it's done, I'll be able to access the chamber below Hikaro's throne. And ether. Outlander, the chief awaits you in the arena, past the throne. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Past the throne? This way? This must lead to the arena. Up, oh, found Another it. Part of the ruins turned into a fighting ring. Look at them all. They know a battle is coming. <laughs> Aloy, it seems you've had to move mountains to bring the Sky Clan to heal. Literally. Literally. Katara <laughs> helped. Yes. Dakota <coughs> reprimanded for all the clan to see. You both served well. But now the cool route is at hand. Some have come to compete, others to bear witness. They know Regala will come for me. I'll do whatever it takes to hold up my end as long as you remember yours. So what's the plan? Katalo. There are only two viable ways to attack the arena. Through the throne room you just passed, 
and by the trail on the north end. We've set up barricades at both. But if Regala means to assault the cool route with machines, she will have to attack by the trail. You will join our defenders there. Hold the line, and I'll have my marshals. You will be free of my service and receive your reward. Make whatever preparations you must. Once the cool route begins, you must see it through. Okay. Uh, the arena. The grove, <clears throat> the arena. It's all part of the same ancient structure? Yes. Here the land remembers the sacrifice of the ten. Their deeds commemorated for eternity. Sacrifice? The visions tell us that on the ground below, they gave their lives in a fight against machines. We honored them by holding the cool root where they fell. Uh, where will you be? I know where I'll be. What about you two? I will be here with the chief, where I belong. Should the fight reach us, we will take the blood owed for our fallen. If it comes to that, the defenses will hold. Nice. Let's get started then.